If this gives you any idea of the neighborhood, this guy's got two different color shoes on. And all his windows are up. Uh, got trash bags on. Very, very strange. That's the way you get out of here. Uh, Turn around, go straight back the way we came. Very, very strange. Is he just gonna sit in that car? I don't even run. Anything no, he can go straight. Go straight. Go straight. And that's what he's gonna do too. Today's a big day, folks. It's Valentine's Day. And uh, special happy Valentine's Day to all of you. If you've got a significant other, I hope that today is a really special day for you and yours. And if you don't, don't feel bad. Uh, good things come to those who wait. Also, keep this in mind as well. It could be a lot worse. You could be locked up in prison with a significant other who's out there in the free world worrying about all the wrong things and worrying about where Jody is taking your significant other on Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day is probably one of the worst holidays that you can be locked up for because Jody is never more real. That boogeyman, that mysterious figure that's bound to take your girl while you're locked up, Jody, the infamous monster underneath your prison bunk, is never more real than on this special day, February the 14th. But today, folks, not only is it Valentine's Day, it's also the day where Rabbit is moving out of the hotel. And he's getting ready to move into this trailer with a friend of a friend, some guy that he doesn't know all that well, some guy that we've never met. Hopefully today, we're gonna get a chance to meet that guy. Uh, but one thing that we definitely do know is that this guy, he's not feeling the cameras. I guess it's been asked already. And he's just not really feeling that. So I got to respect that man's wishes. I don't want to get Rabbit evicted from some place before he's even had a chance to move in there. And even if the guy doesn't feel comfortable with the cameras, I'm hopeful still that we'll get a chance to meet this guy, feel him out. He'll get a chance to feel us out. Hopefully it'll be a, a good introduction. And hopefully this is going to be a really good fit for Rabbit. Again, this is something that he put together for himself. We didn't have any part of this. What we are gonna have a part of is helping him to move and also helping him to get a bed and possibly some other things that he probably needs. The man doesn't have anything. So we're on our way right now to go get with Dave and then go pick Rabbit up. And today is not only Valentine's Day, today is not only the day that Jody could potentially strike if you were locked up. This is Jody's favorite day of the year. But it's also moving day for Rabbit. Hello. Always blazing. Always blazing. I'm the uh, I'm the Mormon ministry. Do you have a moment for uh, for I the have, word? I have. A... Dave, it smells of like marijuana in here. No, it don't. <laughs> Or bacon, one or the other. <laughs> What's going on, man? Who's been sleeping on the couch? Oh, I slept. What'd you do wrong? I slept down here. What'd you do wrong, Dave? Nothing. I found out that uh, Slippers is a boy. What? Yeah. Your, your cat? That one right there is not a girl. That's a boy. You thought it was a girl? Yeah, it's balls dropped. So he's got some... Their things no longer look the same. Are you checking out his balls with the camera? <laughs> That's cool. Hey, cat, you got some balls now. <laughs> so what about this one? Eh, she's still mascara. She's still a girl. So you're going to have all sorts of cats because they're going to have you. No, Peter's going to help us with that. Snip, snip, tuck, tuck. <laughs> so, today... We're moving rabbit. Yeah. We are moving rabbit. Rabbit is waiting on us right now. So what do we gotta get? I mean, we gotta get him some stuff. He needs a bed. 
Yeah, he needs a bed. How are we moving a guy that doesn't have anything to move? We're picking him up and probably just some bags of clothes. He's probably got some food stuff that he's bought that's in the refrigerator that he wants to bring with him, I'm sure. Well, we ought to look out for him today, man. We ought to try to get him a bed, maybe get him some groceries or something. I think he'll appreciate it. I really do. Yeah. I mean, he's already nervous, man. I was just talking about that before I got over here, talking about change. And I, yeah, and I asked him, I was like, nervous? I mean, you, you've met the guy. He's like, Dave, it ain't that, man. It's like, it's like I'm moving to a new pod. I was like, yeah. I, bro, it, you, you hit me right here. I, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. All up in the fields. All right, well, we ain't got a lot of time, so let's get the show on the road. Are we taking the cats with us? Uh, Cat. If I ever come home and my cats are missing... I'm coming to your house. I'm doing good, man. You know, I'm, I'm uh, you know, I, I'm, I'm a little nervous. I'm, you know, I'm concerned. You know, uh, uncharted territory, Joe. You know what I mean? For so, sure. You know, um, you always, you know, always concerned when you're moving into a situation that you don't know anything about. So. But you're optimistic. Yeah, uh, most definitely. The major reason for my move is financial. Okay. Um, the, the. The only reason for this move is financial, okay? If it weren't for that, I would stay here, okay? Um, You're gonna save a lot of money living right. here. That's, exactly. I'm gonna save a lot of money by moving there, okay? Um, I mean, you know, I've been locked up before around people that I couldn't stand. So, and, and I mean, I was in- Close quarters. Close quarters. Yeah. So, you know, being in a, in a, in, a, in a trailer where I have room, you know, to go outside or get away or whatever, you know, I'm gonna be okay, you know? Well, Rabbit, and one thing, let's say this for sure, we're not saying that you're not gonna be able to stand the guy. Right, right, I don't even know the guy, so, you know. We got every reason to believe the guy's gonna be a really good dude. Yeah, I've talked to him several times. His name is Animal, he introduced himself as Animal. And so, a, uh, yeah, so I oh, mean, that gives us a lot of hope. That, right yeah, well, actually, he's pretty, he, he's, he's pretty cool. You know, I, I knew mean, a guy in prison named Animal. I, so. I knew two of them in prison named Animal, and neither one of them were vicious. You know, so I'm, you know, I'm optimistic. You know. <coughs> well, look, you're moving today. Uh huh. What do you have in here that you're taking with? I mean, obviously you're taking all of the stuff, but what yeah. do you have? I, I bought. I stopped yesterday and bought two totes. You know, and uh, I got them both packed, ready to go. Well, we're gonna grab all that, but going to this place, you don't have anything. No. So what do you need? Obviously, you need a bed. Yeah, I just need a bed, you know. Let me have to, have to well, how about we get you a bed? Yeah. Let's get you a TV, because you ain't got no TV, and you watch right. TV. Yeah, Yeah. Uh, well, I, got, I had a buddy of mine that said that he would let me use a TV, you know. We're gonna go see what we can find for you today, Rabbit, because some people have made some donations to what I consider the After Prison Show Fund, and this is money that we use when we're trying to help folks. So today I think it's gonna be a good opportunity for us to use some of that money to help you get some things that not only you, you, you really need, but could also make your situation a little bit better. Yeah, we yeah. come on for that. It, let's go get your stuff real quick and let's get out of here. I don't know where Dave went. All right. Thank you so much, man. All right, man. All Thank right, you. Right. I, I try to clean everything up for you. You know. You good to go. And compared to some of them other rooms, I know you see. Piece of that damn case in my fridge. Mm. This is good. Here's some piece of what I have to deal with some of these damn nasty ass people. I believe. <laughs> hey, look, you have a great day, man. Y'all do the same. You take care now. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. This is heavy. Yeah, you think I'm gonna take care of you? Anything there? I think I'm gonna take a head one, boy. Feel better. <laughs> Actually, this one is a heavy one. Ain't no way. Okay. Thank you, President. That one's got clothes in it. You got ramen noodles in this one. All right, so Rabbit, mm -hmm. I'm off on the next step on my journey. It's ready. Is the guy gonna be there or what's the deal? No, um, actually, I just talked to him a little while ago. He said he was at work. Okay, cool. So. Oh. <coughs> Uh, so, you know, he seems like a pretty decent guy, but he's, I don't know, maybe, I don't know, maybe he's camera shy or something. I don't know, he just don't want cameras. I don't know. Well, we got to respect the man's wishes. There's no doubt about that. If he don't want no filming going on, obviously we need to meet, we, we want to meet the guy. Yeah. But if we're not able to do that today, that's fine. 
Let's go back around the way, Cody, to the Salvation Army right there. So we're gonna go to the Salvation Army. We're gonna try to grab some things. We're gonna try to get you some stuff that could definitely help you. That's so awesome, man. I, you know, I, I, I greatly appreciate everything that you guys are doing for me, and I greatly appreciate the help of the fan base, man. You know, it's... People wanna see you succeed, Rabbit. Without the help that I've received since my release. Well, one thing about it, and we know you are, you're proving it to yourself, you're proving it to us, you're proving it to the world, and because you're willing to give yourself the chance, give yourself a chance, we're going to help you in any way that we can, Rabbit, so long as you just keep doing the things that you're doing. All right, just a quick thought. <laughs> Hear me out. Today is Valentine's Day, and I was just saying, you know, we should get Rabbit, you know, a special lady of the night for Valentine's Day. We can hook him up with one of your old girlfriends. No. Prostitutes are extremely dangerous, and I'm scared. Well, you can't fault us for trying. It's the, it's the uh, thought that counts. <laughs> Greatly appreciate it, though. One from here. And it was a nice mattress, but it was too soft. You need some help, man? You need to find that right in the Yeah, I need some help. Oh, you and me. I need some help getting oh, over here. That's how. I even lowered it down for you. Oh. Not my chair, man. It's all balance. That chair's been drinking today, boy. You don't like it, you try to dump it out. That chair's been drinking today, man. We want to get the uh, the bed right there. Are you going to get the bed mattress? We're going to get the mattress and the box spray. Can we do that? Mm -hmm. And then there's a nightstand around the corner that we want to get. Oh. Do we just need to bring the tag? Yeah, you're going to bring the bottom half of the tag. We should probably go drop all this stuff off. Before we go to Walmart. Heck yeah, Rabbit, you're moving now. Yeah. How's it feel? Feels good. It feels great. You got your own bed now. Right. Thanks. Oh, we ain't done yet. This is, uh... This is change a man's life day today. You yeah. know, we haven't got a chance to do much for you yet, but trust and believe me, we're starting to get her done now. Yeah, it's changing. It's changing dramatically. It's changing for the good, and I'm thankful. I'm grateful. I don't know how to thank you guys. Man. There's gonna be a day. Don't <laughs> hey. worry about it. Don't worry about that. There this will reminds, be a day. This reminds me of the day that I got out. Joe took me to the same place and bought me the same size bed. <laughs> Did I? You don't remember taking me and getting me a twin? <laughs> All right. That's crazy. We're at Walmart. <sighs> Welcome to Wally World. Now, folks, I hope this doesn't turn into a totally different video. And what I mean by that is we got Rabbit's bed and nightstand back here. It should be safe, right? I mean, who would steal something from Walmart? <laughs> that wasn't that supposed to that wasn't supposed to be i don't think that was really as funny as you guys are making it out to be so folks what we're getting ready to do is we're getting ready to get rabbit a couple of things but when you think about it in terms of what rabbit needs he probably needs a whole lot of things he needs a bed set he needs a towel he needs a washcloth he needs some grocery items he probably needs some clothes he wants a tv we're going to get that for him so this is what we're getting ready to do. Rabbit, you're about to be the first contestant on the After Prison Show shop till you drop. Hell yeah, I'm in. Well, here's how it goes. If you can fit it in the cart, you can get it. Okay. All right? Deal. Thank God you can't fit one of them tractors in that I cart. Bet, I bet. 
How big are the cars again? <laughs> you can put it in the cart and you can take it to the park. We've got the after prison show fund. A couple of people have donated to that and it gives us the opportunity to be able to do things like what we're doing with Rabbit right now. And this is made possible by all of you. Grab that cart, Rabbit. All right, Rabbit. Let's go straight back. Let's go to the TVs first. We gotta buy the TV back there, or can we just put it in the cart? The little ones you can put in the cart. The bed and the bag is right here, and the towels are right here. All right, well, let's go over here first and throw this. What color towel and washcloth? Does it matter? No. I'll get That's you terrible. a dark one. How about so a pillow, Rabbit? Uh, yeah, right here. It don't matter which one. Well, Rabbit, you can get any kind of pillow you want. You want a nice pillow? No. So, I just want a pillow that holds my head. It don't have to be a nice one. I want the cheapest one. I mean, realistically, I don't care. You know what I mean? How about this? Feel this. It's a memory foam. That's fine. Yeah, I mean, you know, I don't care. You know, I'm not picky about stuff like that. I just want whatever I hold my head on the bed, bro. You know what I mean? Yeah, you, know, you gotta remember what I've been sleeping on most of my life. You know? Got two towels perfect. and a big. That's perfect. Thank you. All right. What about bed sets? There you go. How about this one? The Mario. I, I kind of like that, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the, but, but now you picky, huh? Nah, I mean, oh, but now I you mean, picky. I mean, oh, I don't okay, care what it is, you know? That's kind of cute, man. I get you this My Little Pony shit over here. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, do they have a uh, door to explore? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yeah. Blue. <coughs> gray. I'm a fan of blue. Uh, you know, I, I've, I've been with gray for a long time now. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, perfect. Slammed up. Okay. Cool. It's just in the cart. Now remember, when the cart gets filled up, that's it. Uh, we better go get your TV now. <laughs> <laughs> Straight to the electronics. <laughs> now, when we were at the thrift store, <clears throat> they had an $89 piece of junk TV. What kind of TV can we get for close to that price? Brand new. Brand new. Oh, they got antennas too. You want to get an antenna? Yeah, he's going to need one. Do I have to have one? He wants TV channels one. for free, yeah. Okay. What do you I think about I this it. one? And whichever one works. I mean, I don't know what, that? you know, I, I don't know anything about the technology, bro. Okay, well, we'll come back to these. Let's find him a TV huh. first. 138. 32 inch LG. Oh, that's, that's a, that's a good fucking TV. That's a good TV. That's a really good TV. That's a good point. Uh -huh. That's a damn good point. That's a perfect. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you just ran out of room. That's it. Okay. I'm good with that. I'm all right. Man, that's, that, man, that's more than enough. All right, let's get you an antenna for the TV. Yeah, let's, right. let's go get that white one. The white one or the black one. Either one's good. All right, we're good. Let's get the antenna. You got food items in your... Uh, and your tote. Mm -hmm. What about washer and dryer? Is that a washer and dryer over there? I don't know. I mean, if he has one or not, there's a laundry mat right near where we're going. Yeah. You want to get him a thing of yeah. detergent? Is that why you were saying that? Yeah, wash it. Well, Let's get you some washing stuff. <laughs> you need a coffee machine? I ain't got one. You want to get one? Coffee maker? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. I'm going to stop asking. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I didn't think about that. <laughs> That's a good thought. Yeah. 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 So whatever we can, we're gonna put between the black screen and the mattress. So like, oh. like you can put the TV laying down instead of box mattress. Now, but we can have the same box on the mattress. 
You better hope the box bringing the mattress is still on the straw. <laughs> I still see it. Well, Rabbit, how does it feel to have a lot more going over to this place than what you originally had? <laughs> man, I'm, I'm, I'm pretty happy. I'm stoked, man. I'm confident. I'm overwhelmed. You know, I'm kind of, I'm kind of emotional. I'm really thankful and grateful. Thank you, you guys. And thanks to all the people that, that helped out that donated to the program and for, for y'all to be able to help me out. Heck yeah. All right. Well, next stop is, uh, is Rabbit's new place. So let's go. Look at the road in this place. Okay. I tell you, I used to ride my dirt bike back here. Okay, Rabbit, this is pretty decent, man. What are we going, camping? Oh, oh my man. God. We got the truck. Thank God we got the truck. If you're driving any kind of a sedan back here, RIP to your undercarriage. RIP to the moped. RIP to the moped all day. You gonna be on the street over there on the side or not? I mean, this is uh, yeah, no, I know. How to yeah, you may need to hit the four wheel drive here, Cody, because we're about to hit a major pothole right here. Go down, yeah, to the right, to the right. Uh, Yowzers. That's not a commonly used road, though. Most people take them right, yeah, come in right from right there. here, Joe. Yeah. I mean, is somebody living here? Like, what the freaking? Oh, no, that I'm, got burned down. Nobody though. living there. Straight on by. That one was burned down. But if you look, this where this oh, where yeah. most people come in at. Oh, okay. I missed it because uh -huh. I couldn't remember. Now this is where I used to chill at. Is this one? This one. This one right here. No, not the one that had the big corner lot. That was this chick Christina's. So, okay, don't judge a book by its cover. All right, we're here. Uh, we don't want to give away too much of this location because of the homeowner's privacy. We are going to showcase Rabbit's room, though, after we get everything uh, situated in it. So right now, we're going to help him get moved, and then we'll showcase a little bit of the conclusion. Uh. Screwdriver? Oh, I got a screwdriver. I got a knife. Let me see that knife. Well, this ain't bad, Rabbit. No, it's okay, man. I mean, you know, that's a new adventure, bro. You know, it's gonna. You using that knife? Bro? It's a beginner. It's a good beginner of the second part of my journey. Yeah, so, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make it the best that I can. For hundred dollars a week. Yeah. So you know I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make the best I can out of it, man. For hundred dollars a week, I'm gonna. I'm gonna try to. I, I, you know, I'm. I'm. A, I'm. I'm gonna grind. Is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do everything I can. I'm gonna try my best. Within 90 to 100 days, up to 120 days, hopefully, to have enough money saved to get my own place. That's my goal. Well, you're off to a good start. You started in the hotel. You were able to find a room for rent. Yeah. That's, you know. <sighs> things, are, things, are a little, things are a little hectic right now, you know. Well, hey, I'm a little stressed, you know what I mean? I'm, I'm, I'm a little on the nervous side. I mean, it's just a, you know, it's just the, uh, it's just a change of territory, you know? Well, like we told you. We're here for you no matter what you need. Right. We're hopeful that this is going to be a good environment for you. If for whatever reason it's not, yeah. you know, we'll, we'll do what we have to do to, to make sure that you get immediately to a better situation. Right. And, and, and with no doubt whatsoever, if things start going sideways out in left field, I won't hesitate to call. I'm not going to let anything trick up what I've got going on right now. I'm doing better than I ever have before, and I'm not going to slow down. Hi, 
if this gives you any idea of the neighborhood, this guy's got two different color shoes on. And all of his windows are up. Uh, got trash bags on. Very, very strange. That's way to get out of here. Uh, Turn around, go straight back to the way we came. Very, very strange. Is he just gonna sit in that car? I don't even run. Any no, you can go straight. Go straight. Go straight. That's what he's gonna do too. He's gonna sit right there and get drunk. <laughs> 